Joe Jewett and Jack DeVos over the line on 610 WTVN. Huh? La- last week, yeah. I want to say this to you real quick. So last week I complained. Really? Of, you complained about something? That's so unlike me. I complained about something on social media from last week. Okay. A little bit, if you All remember. Right. Last week was the week where everybody was like, I went to see 10 of these concerts. Yes, only. Yes, I really only yes, went to see yes, nine. Yes. <laughs> okay, that thing. It's disappeared. It's It's gone. Um, this week, oh, what you, uh, okay. <laughs> this week, and I know, I know you disagree with me. All right. Uh, this week I had a day in it that I least look forward to every year. And oh it, man, you're going to complain I, about I, May the 4th. I can't stand it. Oh, when come I, on. When I wake let up keep, let and, the nerds have a day. And I don't want to take away anything from anybody, but I will tell you when I wake up every year, the first thing in the, on May 4th every year, the first thing I'm conscious of is the date. And I'm like, oh, these people are coming out of the woodwork today. I don't even have to it's look. I know. It's harmless. Well, and it's I a know. one day. I know. I'm, I'm much more of a Star Trek fan than a Star Wars fan, but I'll tell you what's even worse than May the 4th. What's even worse than May the 4th is the people who can't let it go the next day, and they're like, Revenge of the Fifth! <laughs> I can't take it so much! Well, I will tell you also, people should also keep in mind from a history standpoint that May 4th was when the students were shot at Kent State. Well, you're and a that, Debbie that, Downer, aren't wow, you? Wow, no, okay. I'm just saying that is, a, that is a very, that's a, you know, my my grandfather was a teacher at Kent State, my mother was a student, so they were both on campus when that happened. So I'm just saying there are bigger things. However, I will also tell you, I love Love the May the 4th thing. May the 4th be with you. It was clever the first time. Uh-huh. How many Revenge times, how many times has this been Oh, been man, now? my wife has texted me. Uh-oh. Is it about this? Joe is right. I said the same yes! thing. <laughs> Ugh. Kissy emoji. Kissy emoji. Well, at least she ended with something strong. <laughs> and I appreciate the support. <laughs> no, she... Okay, uh, no, she's... the On May the 3rd, she said... Like it was like eight thirty PM on May the third. She went, Oh my god, tomorrow is May the fourth. <laughs> <laughs> Facebook is going to be intolerable. And I said, Yep, get ready. That's so Buckle funny. up. That's so funny. <laughs> All right. It's just, it's a harmless thing. I know. It I is know. a harmless thing. I, I just like it. So much, it. It's so much worse when it drags into the second and, day. And Again, and blah, blah. just stay off social media for that day. Now, look, the Revenge of the Fifth thing was How funny. How many times you have to stay off social media? The Revenge of the Fifth thing, I will, I will grant <laughs> you this. The Revenge of the Fifth thing was funny the first time someone said it. Yes. And I and that first time was like three years ago. Yes. And so when I get stuff, they go, oh, Revenge. Oh, like, okay, it's uh, yeah, whatever. You, you, you missed that bus and you missed the cab and you missed the, the bicycle cab and you've missed, you know, the Uber. It's yeah. uh, 